Hey friends, you all, and I appreciate you stopping by to chat for a while. Um, I wanted to make this certain video at the end of July, but um, I was having phone issues and could not make that happen. So I just got a phone, and um, I got a phone last night, so I'm back in business now. <laughs> I really wanted to participate in Vlogist, but um, due to phone issues, I could not make that happen. So this month I'm going to be making just all kinds of videos, um, nothing in particular, just maybe random videos of doing different things. I'm not going to call it Vlogist because I don't know if it'll be daily or what, but I'll just do as many videos as I can this month as my goal. So, And if there's certain videos you would like to see, just tell me in the comments and I'll try my best to make that happen. No promises though. <laughs> Okay, first up, Jasmine is modeling a dress that I made. It's a crochet dress using a bag day pattern, and also the hat is a sun hat, and it is also a bag day pattern, and I will try to leave those links in the description box below. The um, doll I had originally made this dress for is in Dolly Surgery, so she can't model it right now, so Jasmine has to model it. And sitting beside Jasmine is a teddy bear that I had loom knitted several years ago. So he's just, I pull him out during um, patriotic holidays. And so he is just joining us today before he goes back in the box. Also, the doll I had made this dress for has one fourth limbs. And that means that most, most of her arms and legs are cloth. And then she just has hands and feet. And so I had made these pants to go under her dress. And it looked so cute together. I didn't put those pants on Jasmine because um, they would be too small for her waist. She's a little chunky in the waist. So the pants wouldn't fit her. But thank you, Jasmine, for modeling the crochet dress today. Doesn't she look so happy to be here modeling for y'all? Next up, we have baby, and those are bag day patterns also. The shorts are actually newborn pants by bag Day's Crochet. Um, if you go to her YouTube channel and go to her playlist and look up little girl dresses, it is in that playlist. And I just shortened the pants to make them into shorts and added the red suspenders. And I just made the bow tie up myself. And then the hat, I believe, also is a bag day crochet pattern. <clears throat> but his little outfit come together really cute. Um, I love making little holiday outfits for him. So far, I've done the um, St. Patrick's Day, Easter, and then 4th of July. So I'm sure I'll be making more little outfits for Baby Jacks. And he is another happy one. Doesn't he look so happy to be wearing his crocheted clothes? <laughs> And now we have baby Jesse. He is showing off his little American flag baby cocoon that I loom knitted for him. I've been loom knitting different holiday cocoons for him. And I also um, crocheted him a little hat with a star on it. But I accidentally put too many points and so it looks like a starfish instead of a star for a flag. <laughs> but he did not complain not one bit. He loved it, and he was just happy to be in the 4th of July parade. And last, she is wearing a flag dress that I crocheted for her. And she is wearing some dress shoes with some ruffly socks. Tallulah wears a size 2 in clothes, and so... I used the skills I've learned from making bag day crochet dresses and I just made her a dress to fit her and I, I just made this by like trying it on her every couple of rows to see that I was going in the right direction for her and actually this wasn't the original dress I made 
made her address before this as my, you know, testing and seeing that I could do it. And um, the problem with that was I didn't write what I was doing down. I was just trying it on her and then adding a couple more rows and trying it on her. And then so after I made that dress and it fit her so good, I decided I wanted to make this flag dress for her. And um, I couldn't remember what I did. So I just kind of looked at each row and kind of winged it. <laughs> But I did write it down that time. <laughs> so anyway, that's her dress that she wore for 4th of July. She looks very cute in it. So here we have all of them together. Jas Jasmine, Tallulah, holding baby Jacks and then uh, holding baby Jesse and then baby Jacks looking on and the teddy bear that I loom knitted <laughs> so I want to say thank you for watching guys I appreciate you and like I said I'm gonna try to do as many videos as I can this month as long as my health allows me but yeah give me some video suggestions in the bottom um, in the comments below and I will be moving into my doll yarn room this month so I'm sure there's gonna be videos of that getting set up in the dolly yarn room <laughs> so I appreciate you all watching and I'll see you all again very soon thank you